the coccyx is at the lower end of the spine below the sacrum. The lower back is called the lumbar vertebrae, followed by the sacrum, and then the coccyx, the tailbone. The coccyx is a very small bone, and most of the doctors are not familiar with it. The coccyx provides important attachment to the tendons, ligaments, and muscles. Lumbosacral spine x-rays and MRIs will not show the coccyx. If you want to view the coccyx, order coccyx views or MRI. Dynamic views of the coccyx with the patient is sitting and leaning backwards is the best to image the coccyx. We will compare these x-rays to a non-weight bearing films with the patient is standing or lying to the side. Excessive movement of the coccyx is abnormal. The coccyx is a shock absorber. When sitting, it shifts slightly forward. The coccyx bear more weight when the person is sitting and leaning backwards compared to when leaning forward. Coccyx pain symptoms Coccidenia includes pain during sitting or when getting up from sitting, pain above the anus in the middle, pain improves when leaning forward or leaning to the side, local tenderness just above the anus. The most frequent causes of coccyx pain include falling in the buttocks or backwards, Fracture dislocation due to trauma or injury. Malignancy. Watch out a tumor in the coccyx. Watch out chordoma of the coccyx. Infection. Pregnancy and labor. Idiopathic without any apparent cause. Falling on the tailbone can lead to coccyx pain. We call it coccidemia with chronic inflammation of the sacrococcygeal joint. Dislocation of the coccyx occurs when there is a separation of the coccyx from the sacrum. These are the published types of coccyx injuries. Anterior dislocation, posterior dislocation, anterior angulation, hook Coccyx, a lot of people think it's a big deal in causing the pain in the tailbone. The side bend deformity of the coccyx is another type that causes coccyx pain. The dural tension causing sacrococcygeal syndrome, low back pain, and the other symptoms is a non-proven theory, but I'm going to try to explain it to you. You can see the dural sheath or tube, and distally you see the film terminal. The normal dural tension occurs because the film terminal is connected to the dural tube, and there is that smooth movement of the dural tube as the coccyx moves normally. Excessive curving of the coccyx causes increased dural tension by the pull on the dural tube. And if the coccyx is extended, the dural tube will be relaxed and the tension will be relieved, so as the back pain. This is just a theory, an unproven theory. Treatment of coccyx injuries include manipulation, therapy, cushions for sitting such as donuts and balloons, injections, surgery at the last resort.